Hi, my name is Colin O'Flynn and I'm from Halifax, Nova Scotia, Canada. I designed this little board that I call the Chip Whisperer Lite. This board is designed for teaching yourself all about embedded hardware security research. So, hardware security research is what you need to know about if you're going to use stuff like smart cards in your systems, if you're going to design you know, access control, be it key fobs for a car or anything else. It can also be if you're trying to protect the IP of your company by using cryptography to encrypt firmware or anything like that. There's a whole series of attacks that happen when you take perfectly secure algorithms and implement them on physical devices. These attacks, there's books written about, um, there's been publications for 15 years now at least, there's international conferences that you can go to about them. But a lot of people, be it computer scientists, computer engineers, electrical engineers, makers, don't know about them. The main problem is that the commercial tools are really expensive. So if you were to buy a complete setup, you're looking at, you know, luxury car costs or above, or you can set up your own environment with an oscilloscope and stuff, but you've got to get scripts, you've got to connect all the equipment together. It's a big hassle. So I created the Chip Whisperer project, which in 2014 won second place in the Hackaday Prize out of about 800 entries. $418. So let's name first the Despite being a fraction of the cost winner. of existing solutions, it's still too expensive to reach some students and hobbyists. So I redesigned it as the Chip Whisperer Lite, which is an even lower cost version of my Hackaday Prize entry, bringing the cost down to something like $200. The Chip Whisperer Lite is unlike any other tool you own. It's not a multi-purpose tool or board. It's not Arduino compatible, it doesn't run on the Raspberry Pi, and it's not trying to replace your oscilloscope. Instead, it's designed for one function. It's designed as a platform for teaching yourself about embedded hardware security. When you're done running through all these published tutorials that form a core part of the documentation, the board is designed to just snap apart. Half the board becomes an instrument for analysis of other devices or to use as a general purpose hardware security instrument. So let's look at this main board itself. It uses an Atmel SAM 3U microcontroller loaded with custom open source firmware which communicates with and configures the Spartan 6 LX9 FPGA. The FPGA interfaces to a low noise amplifier with up to 55 dB of gain, uh, it has a 10 bit ADC, and it also talks to this target section. So the target section is an Atmel X Mega microcontroller. You can program the target microcontroller with the algorithm you're attempting to break or learn about, so it's really up to you. To make this project a reality, we're using a Kickstarter campaign to fund our initial production order. This means we don't have to compromise our vision of making this field of study more accessible, as no constraints are imposed on us by any external sources of funding. Because the Chip Whisperer Lite is heavily based on our current product line, most of the R&D is already done. The open source software already supports the Chip Whisperer Lite, so all that's left to do is order the first run, update the documentation, train our quality assurance manager, and ship the boards to you. We are creating a revolution in the embedded hardware security market by providing low-cost open source tools that raise awareness of this critical area of embedded security. We hope that you'll support our project, and if you don't want a Chip Whisperer Lite, you can always decide to buy a treat for our QA manager, Luna, who's always on the job.